Super Bowl halftime show announced this week. Big, exciting show. Jennifer Lopez and Shakira in the biggest media concert that everyone in America will see at some point in February. People are scratching their heads as to why you would cast these two women who really, combined, haven't had a hit in 15, 20 years, and here's why. As we speak right now, the NBA is on a tour of India with some of their teams. Uh, the Buffalo Sabres, who started this week playing, they're going to be playing regular season hockey games in Sweden this year. Major League Baseball kicks off every year over in Asia, and they play a couple of games in Mexico, sometimes Cuba, Puerto Rico, things like that. If the NFL is bad at one particular thing, it's growing their game internationally. You have your England series, but that's been a little bit weird. You play some games in Mexico every once in a while, and back in the day, they would play games in Asia preseason. They call it the American Bowl. But as of right now, at least over the last 20 years, the NFL has done really nothing to try and grow the game globally. That's what this halftime show is all about. Shakira, as much as you don't care about her now, is still a global icon. They're hoping to get eyes on this game from around the world so they'll fall in love with the game. But I don't think it works. The only way to get cultures that aren't into your sport into your sport is to go there and do it. The NBA did it. They have been phenomenal doing it. If the NFL wants to make this work, you need to find a way to go overseas, bring your product to them, instead of putting out some woman whose hips haven't lied in like 17 years. <laughs>